So, hey, this is the 24th day of the Technique Challenge, and I'm gonna show you a, a pass that I, I've been trying to work on. Like I, I've, I've probably invested several years on this pass, all right? So I have some modifications I can give you. It's the Wilson Pass, the close guard. So, this is a low posture pass, all right? So instead of like standing or keeping upright, strong posture, I'm gonna go down and I wanna underhook and four fingers in the back of the collar. I'm going to pull this collar down because I want I want to twist his spine slightly. So my elbow, my elbow is going inside my knee as much as possible. Other hand goes inside the bicep, both elbows to the hip. All right. Now I want to keep this curvature of the spine as much as I possibly can. I also want to get my head right here. Like traditional will say, you like you do like a shuffle step. But I found that it's much easier for me to drive my head into the space. So I come up with my toes, keep my head low, and I drive off my toes into the space right here. And then I'm gonna switch my hip. When I switch my hip, I'm trying to get my back leg as high as I possibly can. And also, I also wanna keep my head low. I'm putting it high so you can see me. But ideally, as I come up, I want to put my head right on this side of the chin and make it look this way. So, like, as I switch, I'm looking to go right here and then pull this arm up and keep walking higher. Hips off the deck. The reason I make him look, this, look in this direction is because this is away from where he wants to take my body. If he's looking this way, it's easy for him to tell me. Argh. So, I want to make him look this way so when he's trying to tell me, can't carry the force. It's really hard. And that makes everything I do easier. So I'm here, which I'm moving. Can't carry the force. Okay. Ah. We had collision on the entry, on the exit. Wanna try now? Yeah. Alright. How you feel now? Pressure? Oh, God. Deep. Four fingers in the collar. Pull. Twist the spine. Cup the bicep. Elbows tight. Trying to get my head into the space right here. That's going to make my hip switch more powerful. It's also going to take away the, the leg. It's going to make it harder for me to recognize what I'm doing. Try to make him look this way. So my head's gonna go up and then down. And then I keep walking my feet higher. And then this hand will come back, push his leg down, spread my base, step over, drop my hip, and then show away. Shoulder head. my variation of the Wilson Pass. I think it's really good. I like it a lot. I, mean, like I spent so much time on that, on that pass, you know? Because it, it worked for me because I just wanted to get the half guard, the top half guard. It was one of the easiest passes from close guard to half guard for me. Play with it. 